Published Wednesday, December 16, 2020, 11.14 am Join AFP's 100,000 plus followers on Facebook Purchase a subscription to AFP, subscribe to AFP Podcasts on iTunes News, Press Releases, Letters to the Editor, Augustafri Press 2 at gmail.com Advertising Inquiries Free press at ntelos.net Kyle Guy at the Final Four in 2019. Photo by Chris Graham. The final seconds counting down, Sacramento down by 2, 113 to 111, Kyle Guy had it in his head. It's preseason. Go for the win. Don't try to tie it up. He got a screen from Chemezi Metu just inside the Kings logo to free him up from Golden State rookie guard Nico Mannion. Warriors forward Caleb Wesson forced him to pump fake. The line drive splashed at the buzzer. Guy, all smiles, was mobbed by his teammates. That's probably the best part of all, just how happy they were for me, said Guy, whose game-winning three finished his night with 20 points on 7 of 11 shooting, 6 of 10 from 3. This, after a nice outing in Sunday's 121-106 win over Portland, in which Guy had 14 points on 4 of 8 shooting, 3 of 7 from 3, in 23 minutes off the bench, has the NBA preseason buzzing. Guy, a second-round pick in 2019 out of Virginia, spent the bulk of his first season as a pro in the G League, where he averaged 21.5 points per game, shooting 41.3% from the floor and 40.1% from 3 for the Stockton Kings. That year shuttling between Stockton and Sacramento did Guy some good. Physically, I found about 10 pounds, said Guy, now listed at 6 feet 1 inch, 167 still light, by NBA standards. The biggest adjustment, playing the point, after getting the bulk of his minutes at Virginia at the 2, alongside another future NBA player, Ty Jerome, a first-round pick last year by Phoenix, now in Oklahoma City. In high school, I had the ball in my hands a lot, and then when I got to college, I was kind of like a little bit more off the ball. We had Ty Jerome and Kihei Clark, so I was forced to be off the ball more, and so I've always had it, and just getting back in the groove of it was what again, the G League helped, Guy said. He's still more Steph Curry than John Stockton, averaging 17.4 shots per game in Stockton in 2019-2020, as he dished out 4.8 assists per game. The NBA hasn't been about point guards dumping the ball into the post and dropping back on D since the days of Stockton to Malone. Guy fits well into the modern landscape. He just needs somebody willing to give him a look. Kings coach Luke Walton put some water on the fire post game. What he's doing is he's building